Hello everyone, and welcome back to Timberborn Season 1. Last episode we established the colony, and we got a dam, made it through the first dry season, and I think on this episode we're going to try and venture up to this natural dam. Try and break through that, get some water coming down, that way we can have two sources of water since the water from this water source has not even arrived after part of the day down here so I think we'll have to get that figured out. I'm taking a look at what we have here there's a lot of trees have started growing and resources we have some good wood but we will need to get some water because we are a little low so if we start this out although we do have four unemployed beavers so we'll need to pause some jobs and we have a lot of food right now so I think it's okay to pause that I think we can probably pause this chestnut or the gatherer flag probably one of these workers also Okay, I think this should be, okay we have enough beavers here now. So I think first things first, um, we gotta get some paths and wooden stairs are the way that we're going to be getting up to the top of that hill. You'll need to create a row of trees to be chopped down so that we can get a path set up all the way up there. And since we have all these beavers sleeping outside, they actually have negative well-being since the update. They used to not care about, they being the iron teeth, used to not care about shelter, but now they do. So I think we want to probably get two of these built. We have plenty of wood. Okay, so now we have this set up and this beaver. Where is he? It's getting it's going to the job. Nice and so it begins. We'll also need to unlock platforms and we have enough science. If we can get this built then we can get the trees planted sooner, and the sooner we will not have to worry about running out of wood. Nice, we have someone here planting away. And he's hungry. Got some food. They like the houses, that bumped up their happiness. We also like shrubs. We'll save that for later. Look at that, another level. I really do like the houses. Okay, how is this coming along? I guess they almost have this one. I'm just waiting for some more planks. I think we'll want to start getting this dam ready. Because once we have the water flowing down, we'll want to keep this area wet. Eventually we could probably make some cool water canals through here. I really could do some cool stuff with this. This is just such a big volume of water. Yeah, eventually I think I'll want to get up here and dam this thing but that is gonna be quite the endeavor so that's something we'll focus on today so I think we should probably start thinking about where we're gonna be processing the wood and where we are going to be turning them into planks and gears yeah I think I'll probably put over here that way it can be be close to the 
to the river for a water wheel. Oh no, it's not. Even if we do this, ah, oh, yikes. Now, how do we do that? What we can do is do this. Here we can set up another district. And then we'll be able to ha transfer some there to demolish that. Who is the unlucky soul? Trollgar. Rise and shine. Gotta get the barrier demolished. Yep. He's gonna wade through the water. He's braving the elements. So now that the water is flowing, we can get this dam built. Still have a lot of wood. So I think we want to unlock this gear workshop. And get another lumber mill set up. Although we might not be able to use it. We won't want to use it yet. I do think we want to get these started. Okay, this is what we're going to get set up next. But we need to make a way for them to get down to the water. Okay, with all this done, we can migrate you back. Service. And now we don't need this. Oh, let's just get this one done. I think it's probably going to be good to expand food. Speaking of which, and we got the drought coming. Because really, really what I want to do is put another level on top of these houses and use a double platform to place another another barracks on top of that. That way we can expand vertically, keep all the beavers nice and close to each other. We should really give them a campfire, because these beavers now you know, benefit from that. Yeah, campfire and roof rooftop terrace. Okay, looks like we have these buildings complete and people in there, but we don't have this ready. I should pause that. Can they reach there? No, we have to prioritize this. We have one day left until the dry season. We got some unemployed beavers. Some more trees growing over here. They can chop down. And we're finally making gears. Oh good, so these are all in range. Okay, get some gears set up. And we'll be able to get the high powered shafts just in time for the drought. So, I don't know how useful It'll be in that regard, but we can still get it set up. Okay, so I think this is this is what we're, we're looking for, so we can expand it both directions, but we will also need to get a battery system and to store the extra power, but that's going to be down the road. 
So the drought's only 1.7 days, but I think that's where we're going to end it for today. And we'll next time we'll pick it up in the drought. And that should do it. Thank you for watching. Catch you next time. Bye.